What's up? I am Deffy Marsden. Welcome to the channel. Here I am in Guarma as John, and I need to get back to the mainland. I'm playing on Xbox One, post epilogue, and there's clearly a restricted area around Guarma where the possibility of me being shot by an invisible sniper is real. I went there to fill out the compendium and still needed a few animals from Guarma, some Guarm animals, if you will. I don't use cheats because I like to save my progress so I don't have a horse and I'm not taking a donkey. To get to Guarma, I used the get drunk next to a cliff glitch and I'll link the video I watched to accomplish that below in the description should you like to do it yourself and don't know how. The problem is I didn't find many videos on how to get out of Guarma when I initially looked and of the ones I found, None were really for my situation. They either used a cheat to spawn a horse or they don't have a restricted area with invisible snipers shooting at them. And I've seen a few that told how to go certain paths to get through the restricted area without being shot. None of that worked for me. My objective the whole time has been don't bring unnecessary attention to myself, and I found that's the trick to getting through the restricted area with no sniper shooting at you, and that's the reason I'm making this video. This is something I haven't heard anyone else say about it. When you come across anyone, citizen or guard or whatever, say hi to them. It has worked 100% of the time for me. Since I figured it out, the only time I got a sniper shooting at me was when I accidentally fired my gun by hitting the right trigger to look through my binoculars, except I didn't have my binoculars selected. Or if I tried to say hi to someone and was a little too far away and John screamed it. Sir! Hola. As you can see here, I screamed at these guards and eventually started getting shot at by the sniper. When this happened, I just reloaded the save and tried again because just like Arthur and New Austin, there's no getting away from the sniper. What the hell? While looking for the rest of the animals I needed for my compendium, I spent a lot of time going from place to place all through the restricted area, and by doing this, I had no issues with the sniper at all. While you don't have to avoid anyone, going a path that takes you past fewer people is a good idea regardless. Again, just trying to minimize attention. If you want to try taking a donkey so the trip back is a little faster, there's usually at least one donkey here. You can see there's two now, but I'm not risking it. I'm also not taking a donkey to make the trip easier because that's technically stealing and that's unnecessary attention. The two times I took a donkey, I was taken out by the sniper. You don't have to say hi to everyone you come across, like when I saw a group of guards standing together. I just said hi once to someone from the group and that seemed to be fine. Excuse me. Hola. I also didn't run through the restricted area, I just walked through it, said hi to everyone, and even went out of my way to walk up to them if they weren't close enough so that I didn't yell, and I've had no issues. Hi, fellas. Hola. Hey. Hola. You can go any path, but this was my favorite. It gets you through the restricted area pretty quickly, and even though I'm out, I still continued walking through the field until I'm about halfway through it before I start running. You probably don't have to do this, I just did it to be extra safe because I found out early on that you don't necessarily have to be in the restricted area to trigger the sniper. Then, set a waypoint somewhere around here. If you also need to fill out the compendium, the boas typically spawn in these areas, 
And if you don't find what you need, keep trying those locations, maybe walk away for a little while and go back, or save and load back in. It took me a while to get all three boas to spawn, but eventually they did, and I got them all by the bottom of the E in day, next to a fallen tree near where you load in. The red-footed booby can be found in this area, typically flying overhead in a group, and I found mine here on this little peninsula. But apparently they can be seen anywhere along this coast from where the creek dumps into the ocean on up. The McCalls can be found everywhere, and they spawn a lot along the creek from the waterfall to the ocean, so you should have no problem finding those. And the Fertile Ant Snake can be found almost anywhere around, and I saw a bunch of those, so it shouldn't be too hard to find. You'll notice all the red pins I have in the map. The video I used to get to Guarma suggested going to those locations on the way down, so that's why I placed the markers there. Now set a waypoint around here and head there. At some point you'll see the ground disappear and you'll be running through the air above the ocean. I saw another video that suggested turning a certain way once that happens and the ground would come back, but that never worked for me. Maybe because I'm not on a horse or a donkey, I don't know. Now set a waypoint anywhere over here. You won't make it that far, maybe only halfway, before John jumps into the water and begins to drown. You can do this before falling into the ocean and it still works, but if you fall in, don't worry. Just save the game and reload that save and you'll be in rows. You'll see I used a new save spot, but you don't have to. You can overwrite your regular save spot and it'll be fine. So there you go. I hope this helps. Remember to say hi to the guards and you should be just fine.